Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. Wow, um, I don't even know where to begin. It's been almost a year since I've made my last Toy Story update video and I am so sorry. <laughs> the reason it's taken so long is because I have been waiting for one character to show up to my house for eight months. It's taken eight months to get to my house. Um, it wasn't in shipping for eight months, he just he didn't ship it until eight months later because he had to do updates on it. He had to, I don't know why it took so long and there's just a lot of drama behind that. Um, I'll get into it later when I'm actually reviewing who it is. If you couldn't already tell who it is by the thumbnail, you, you, would, you, you would, you know. I've been talking to some of you content creators and other Toy Story fans um, and you, you guys all know who it is, but the, the casual viewers, uh, you'll be surprised. So if you just want to skip to the review of who I'm reviewing and the, the new updates of the Three new characters I got. I got three new characters and then I'll put a timestamp like right here on the Pizza Planet shirt and you can just go to that time and you will be to the review if you don't want to hear about my life and updates and where I've been this entire time and what have I been up to. So what have I been up to? Um, let's see, I got a new job. I have two jobs now. Yeah, I got a job at a five below. That's super fun. I'll show up some videos of me having fun at that job. Super, super fun. Um, my brother got married. That was awesome. He got married in California. Very beautiful. And honestly, just that, just waiting and messaging the dude, cop, it is cop, um, why it took so long, and it's just, it's just, ah! And I feel bad for all of you who've been waiting for so long, because I kept, I kept telling you, soon, 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 whenever, you know, whenever the dude will actually ship my item, and he didn't give refunds either, I said, because after like two months, I'm like, okay, why is this taking so long, like, wh what, what are you doing? He's like, okay, I'll ship it soon, I'll ship it now, I'll ship it soon, um... I'll ship it next week, I'll ship it this weekend, constant back and forth with that. So all that kind of left a bad imprint on me, bad impression, because I don't know if I'm going to be buying from him again. Um, he makes great stuff, he does, but if you want to wait eight months to receive your item, then buy from him. Um, but other than that, uh, if you want it now, if you want it soon, if you were to buy it today, for example, you wouldn't be getting it for eight months, which, because this Wheezy here I bought almost a year ago, um, and it took only like a month to get to my house, so I don't know what the issue was. Um, I thought he scammed me for the longest time because I couldn't get a refund. It was, he was $600, the character I'm going to show, and I couldn't get that money back. He was like, no refunds, once it's done, it's done, um, just PayPal me, and then that was it. So I just had to hope that he would actually ship it and that I would get it this year. Let's start with some updates before we get to the characters. I'll show you what's new around the room. If you can tell, we got a new shelf right here. Um, I'll show you some pictures and up closes right now. Here is what the shelf is looking like. I like this a lot better than when they were all up there. Um, I have some videos and pictures of me putting it right here. Um, it didn't work because of this door. I'll show a video of that from like April when I filmed it. Now it's November. <sighs> I'm so sorry guys. Anyway, here's the collection here. I didn't really want to put Zurg up here, but he can't fit in any of these cubbies, so he has to go up there. And uh, this Bo Peep is pretty cool right here. I like this position for that. This Woody and all of them have been sitting here for months. Look at all this dust on there, on their hats and on here. It's just been such a long time. Um, we got all the boxes there, which I like. I like that. We got Bullseye and Rex here with the 95 VHS there. Potato Head. Aliens, nothing new there. My mom actually gave me this for when I have a kid someday. <laughs> so that's pretty funny, I guess. We got RC, Bo Peep, the sheep, and some army men in here. Then we have Mr. Mike. We got Ham, Slinky, Lenny. You know, more of Andy's like original gang. We have some of the, we have some of the Sunnyside gang here. I still need a chunk. That might be the next one. And a Ken. Still need a Ken. Here's like the bottom of the list characters we don't really care about. Um, we got a Trixie. Cop is actually making a Trixie right now. I'll show up some videos. D don't know how much that's going to be, but I know there's some already good Trixies out there, so maybe I'll look at a previous one instead of his because of issues. More irrelevant kind of characters we don't really care about. A ducky Bunny won't go above like Woody or Potato Head or Buzz of characters I care about. You know, you guys get it. Anyway, here is Gabby, Barbie, my Forky that I still am very, very proud of making. I made them very, very good. And, uh, Giggle McDimples. So that's that new shelf. It looks a lot better. Right when you walk in, people see and they're like, whoa, that's so cool. For the eight months, I've been looking for rollerblades too. I love to inline skate. Um, and these were very, very, very hard to find, very rare. 
And if any of you like Toy Story viewers are watching my Jack Skellington video, here's some just my Squishmallows if you guys care about this. I finally got the zero I was looking for, and I still kind of want to collect this entire series as a seven inch ones, but yeah, we'll see about that. Let's actually get into the review. So hello people that skipped the entire life update thing. Here we are for the actual review. So let's start with um, Tinny. Um, side note, all these characters, all three of these characters, um, I've never really said anything in the movies. So there's that to look forward to, if you can kind of guess who's going to be next and stuff. So yeah, here's Tenny. I don't think he really does anything. He can rotate his head all the way around. Um, this is a little flimsy. That's interesting. I think I bought him off Amazon in like March or April, and he's been sitting on the shelf also collecting dust like the other characters for months and months and months because of reasons we've already talked about. But when we get to him, I'll rant more when we get to that guy. So anyway, Tenny, I don't think he really does anything. Um, I think in the movie when he walks like that, you know, he does that and the drums do and the bells and all that, that all that actually, you know, does something. But I think he's just for show. So that's that on him, on Timmy. Next we're going to do is the little troll doll. Um, funny enough, when I bought this on eBay, I believe, um, the shipper put the troll doll in a Pop-Tart box. So that was pretty funny. I'll put some pictures on the screen so you'll see. It's kind of interesting, <laughs> which is a little note that says thank you on it. Pretty funny, but nothing much to the troll either. You know, the hair is nice. It kind of flows it's like that. Uh, kind of crazy hair. Fun stuff like that. But you know, you gotta pose the hair like this, like an ice cream cone. And the outfit's really nice. It's just this little fabric they like hot glued on. The eyes are blue. So this lighting is really, really bad. I'm gonna have to try to fix that too. Here's the bottom of the foot. What does that even say? Russ. Russ. Anyway, let's get to the meat and potatoes of this video, the thumbnail you saw, all the rants that I've been talking about, all the drama this character has caused over the last eight months. Um, here he is. Rocky Gibraltar. Guys, uh, I've been waiting, you know how long, for this guy. I paid $600 for him. Um, there's an option I'll put on the screen here of all of Cop's customs and how much he charges. I got him for 600 and uh, he was charging 750 but that's with the box and for his like certificate but I didn't want to do that I just wanted I just wanted the dude when he when he came in it was broken like this look at this dude look at this dude look at his face I'll block mine look we got some gray by his nose and stuff oh god I'm just gonna have to super glue it you know super super easy fix it's, at least it's not one of the arms or legs that that uh, fell off but uh god this lighting i'm so sorry ha ah, sorry this lighting's so bad uh but it's very very nice good um i'll put a little video right here of me actually opening it so you can see um but my reaction wasn't like wheezy's if you saw that video um for the longest time i accepted that i would never actually receive this guy because because of all that and the money and no refunds and all that i was like he's never he's literally never gonna send it but then one YouTuber made a post, and I appreciate him for doing that. And then he, he sent it. So if you know who you are, you know who you are for doing that. And uh, some other, you know, any other collectors you guys know as well. So that's Rocky Gibraltar. His head, you can kind of turn his head a little bit. I'm not going to force it. I saw today I grew up's video on it, Todd. He's a really cool guy. Check out his channel as well. Um, he did a review on... Picasso's Rocky, but then something happened with that, and we're not going to talk about that. So here's his arms, so you can go straight out, straight up, straight down. His elbow's a little loose right here, but that's okay. Um, his hands don't turn or anything. Um, these look like actual nails. I don't know if these are actual nails or not. Pretty sure they are, unless they... Unless they're just painted to look like that, because when I'm touching this one, it feels like a plastic nail. It doesn't feel like a real nail, which is really, really good attention to detail. But yeah, Rocky Gibraltar, there we have like a little rock, I guess, rock in the ocean. I don't really know what that's about and why that's even on his belt. But but here's his little hat, helmet thing, face. Um, hard plastic, very, very nice quality. Now, this is kind of sharp too. Like you can kind of do some damage with this if you're not careful. It's kind of sharp as I'm touching it, you know. A nice curved shape right here. A little bumpy like it's supposed to be because he's a rock. I get it now. It's supposed to be a rock. I kind of, I literally just figured, 
I literally just made that connection. Oh my god. And I guess that is supposed to be his hat, his head then. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe that's maybe that's pushing too far, but his teeth are nice. Um, the thing I really complained about this guy is if you saw Todd's video, um, he talked about the skin tone and how it's not really accurate. I'll put a picture next to this and we'll kind of take a look um, at the skin tone. Um, his skin tone's a little dark. I don't know why it's dark, but I'll get used to it. And it's not it's not a huge deal to me. It's just a little complaint. He's kind of hard to stand up to. His feet are loose. Um, it's very squeaky. He's made out of this hard plastic rubber, which is super cool. Look at them, look at them shoulders. Nothing on the bottom of his feet, um, unfortunately. I don't think he even had anything on the bottom of his feet. Maybe Andy. Anyway, yeah, I'm just gonna have to hot glue this. It'll be fine. It's wheezy like I was showing earlier. And these are the two cop customs I have. They're super cool, man. This Rocky is so awesome. And I'm glad I have him in my collection. He's His waist can go all the way around. I don't know, maybe not all the way around, but it can twist pretty good as his how it comes off when I do it. Yeah, I'm actually almost there. No, nope, I'm not even gonna try that. I don't wanna break the dude. I didn't wait this long for him just to break the second day I had him, so. Other than that, there's not much to it. I I wish he was in the third movie, like, at least like a little cameo. I think in the beginning of the film, you can kinda see him in the background, but I don't remember. Remember that was like another character like this you can kinda just see in the background, but um, in the little home videos that uh, Andy's mom films of him. But he was in the first and second movie. He never said anything. I think he just grunts a little bit. You can see him working out with Buzz Lightyear in the first movie. He's holding Wheezy on his shoulders like this. I'm saying bye to the, the group while they go find Woody in the second movie. Pretty sure he throws Woody off of the semi-truck in the first movie. I think that's all this guy does in those movies, so. That's Rocky Gibraltar. Let's take some close-up shots and see what he looks like next to some other characters. Here's a better shot of Rocky standing next to Wheezy. Um, Rocky's super, super hard to stand um, as he's standing straight when I show you, of course, on video. But his legs are not straight down just because how it was made with the rubber. If I pose his arms up, he's probably not going to stand as well. Yeah, like the weight just kind of brings him down because he's very topped, like mid-body heavy. Um, and those his little weak legs can't really support him and I'll just fall back on my TV okay so let's stand him up again and uh, let's go get some other characters to look at and here's just a quick shot of like Andy's toys from like the first and second movie because I don't know if Mr. Mike is the actual like scale to scale to Rocky but potato heads there in the back there's Rocky next to like Bo Peep ham isn't to scale either but I'm gonna I'm I'm working on that Mr. Mike Woody Rex all these characters he, he looks so good there's still a lot of Andy's toys that I still need. Um, like the Roly Poly Clown, Etch a Sketch. You guys all made a list for me in the comments in some of my videos, so I will definitely get to that soon enough. Well, I guess I can put some Man in there, but here's that shelf again. It's another look. This is Zerg and Jesse and my baby. Uh, oh, yeah, we got some stickers I didn't use, and here's the certificate of authenticity here. Um, I still literally don't know where to put these. Look up. Look how dusty these are. I put them like right here for like months, so. Um, I had an idea of just putting them like on here. Just like, just like taping them all on there, but I don't know if I'm gonna be doing that. Rocky and the Toy Story Collection Buzz Lightyear. Super, super cool. Uh, he's almost as tall as Buzz, but you know, Woody's the tallest toy, I believe. Um, not so Gabby. Gabby, Gabby's probably the, the taller probably the taller toy but yeah I just need some like weights for them and then Rocky will look complete like I said Woody is one of the taller toys for sure I guess that's not true because he has a stand but Woody is still pretty tall but there they are the height comparison there's me in the back hello actually soon enough I'm gonna be taking a picture of all my toys together and me I'll be posting it on my Instagram so be sure to follow me and uh, like that photo when I eventually post it it'll look really really cool other than that, guys, that's pretty much it for the video. Uh, I'm, I'm so sorry, again, not why it's taken so long. But then again, I guess I could have bought another character to get out a video sooner. But he was the main focus of the whole video that I wanted to talk about, and we finally did it. And he was, he's basically the meat and potatoes of the video, so you guys aren't... Like, if this if this and the troll were the, the whole video, that would be super boring. So I'm trying to bring you guys, you know, the best content I can bring for you the best characters as well and he was definitely one of the top ones even though he's never really said anything in the movie he never really did much in the movie just a side character but the true fans that you know watch this video and subscribe to me 
By the way, you guys got me to 2K subs. That's awesome. Even though I've been posted so long. I'm going to try to post more. Keep leaving comments of who you want to see next, and I will hopefully put that on my list, and we can see those soon enough. I'm going to try to put out one more Toy Story update video before the new year. So look forward to that as well. But Christmas is coming up again. I kind of have to save my money for gifts and stuff, but we'll see. I'm going to try my best to do it for you guys. Oh, actually, look at those little scars right there. Those little... Those little damages, that's not thats not too bad. I actually just noticed it when I was looking at his uh, armpits, but yeah. His arms will be closed like 100% of the time, so it doesn't even matter, so. Not a big issue for me. As I almost rip his arm off, look at this. Yeah, I need to end this video and stop talking about it before I keep breaking him. So enjoyed the video, sorry about the whole rant stuff. Uh, do the things, you know the things. I will see you guys soon. Have a good day, bye.